What's up, YouTube? It's your boy. I'm back with another one showing y'all how to be more explosive athletes. So today, we have sled pulls. We got some leg extensions. That's just for the warm-up. Then we're going to go hit these power cleans and these plyometrics. All right? So first, get you a sled, get you a tire, get you something. I don't know where you at, but get you something you can pull. Maybe a, a rope with a dumbbell or something. But we're going to pull sleds right so we're gonna pull these sleds we're gonna go um let me see i got this 15 15 15 15 <laughs> boy i'm slow 60 uh 60 yard walks that's what we're going with first this is a warm-up we got three sets of this this is only a 15 yard platform so i'm going back and forth back and forth back and forth you know down back down back twice after that we're going to go hit the leg extensions so on the leg extensions, we had like 15 reps. It's just a warm up. So you're just trying to get your knees warmed up because we're about to do power cleans and we're about to do um, plyometric jumps. So you want your knees to be loose because everybody know, well not everybody, but I know that the secret to being explosive is having strong knees and knee crossing muscles. So, all right, so between each set, make sure you stretch. You got three sets of these sled pulls, three sets of leg extensions, then I'm gonna meet you at the power cleans. Get that work. I'ma keep it push, I'ma keep it lift. Man, I'm still here, y'all, keep the mind closed. I'ma keep it push, I'ma keep it lift. Man, I'm still here, y'all, keep the mind closed. Gotta keep going, gotta keep, going. Gotta keep, running. Gotta keep running. Ain't running from none, just run to some Damn, I look good. On the set number three, let's get gotta it. Keep Ain't running from none, just run to some money. I'ma keep push, I'ma keep them look. Made myself a heat, y'all, keep the mind clues. I'ma keep push, I'ma keep them look. Made myself a heat, y'all, keep the mind clues. Gotta keep going. Gotta keep running. Ain't running from none, just running to some money. Gotta keep going. Gotta keep running. Okay, now that your knees are all warmed up, now it's time for us to get into the power cleans. Make sure you got a box set up that's about three inches below hip level. That's for the stretches in between the power cleans. So we're gonna start with something light today. We're gonna have three sets of three on the power clean. So get right. Right here, I just got 135. Nothing too major. Just kicking flavor. You did work on your form, your technique. I'm not the best power cleaner, but I promise you that power cleaning brings results. I did power clean for four weeks straight. The only exercise, probably four to five times a week. I and my broad jump went from a nine six to a ten four in only four weeks. That's almost a whole foot. That's wild. So make let's just to let you know these things they work. So you hit the three power cleans. Then after that you hit two broad jumps. I just jump from one side of the platform to the other because I think it's like nine feet. So just just so I don't cheat myself. You might want to measure something out. You don't want to be jumping eight feet, this and that. You want to jump close to your mats each time. So so right here we're gonna work on our glute stretch. So a lot of people stretch their glutes by just hanging down. That's not how you stretch the glute, the glute. Because the glute goes from inside out. So it goes sideways, the glute muscle. It don't go up and down. So you need to turn that leg sideways and then stretch it. That's how you get uh, mobility in your glute. So I'm just taking five deep breaths and going down and back up. I just like to stretch between sets so I can get a little rest because... You're not doing, like, you know if you're doing squats or if you're doing, like, a lot of burpees and stuff to get you tired, you can feel that you're tired and you know you need to rest. But when you're doing power cleans, especially with lightweight, you don't realize how much tax, uh, how much you're taxing your body and how much your body is going through. So I like to make sure that I'm doing something in between so I don't just go right back into a set because you're probably not going to um, give max effort once you do that so that's the reason that i do these uh stretches in between just to kill some time 
I want to like rest really like four minutes between each power clean set, four to five minutes to get all of my um all of my energy back and ready to explode because you're not tired like i said but your muscles um exerted a lot of energy to explode off the ground even if it's lightweight i always remember that so after you get done with that you're gonna go back you're gonna add weight i went from 135 to 185 to 195 three sets of two stretching in between each set did broad jumps between each set so y'all go ahead and get that work and i'll meet you at applied metrics let's get it thank you thank you I'ma keep pushing. I'ma keep it lit. Made them say we here, y'all. Keep the mind closed. I'ma keep pushing. I'ma keep it lit. Made them say we here, y'all. Keep the mind closed. Gotta keep going. Gotta keep, going. Gotta keep running. Gotta keep running. Ain't running from none. Just running to some money. Gotta keep going. Gotta keep, Gotta keep running. Gotta keep running. Gotta keep running. Ain't running from none. Just running to some money. I'ma keep pushing. I'ma keep it lit. Made them say we here, y'all. Keep the mind closed. I'm a keep push. I'm a keep push. Make sure you stand hydrated. Keep the mind closed. Gotta keep going. Gotta keep, going. Gotta keep running. Gotta keep running. Ain't running from none. Just running to some money. Gotta keep going. Gotta keep, Gotta keep running. Gotta keep running. Ain't running from none. Just running to some money. I'm a keep push. I'm a keep push. Made them say we here, y'all. Keep the mind closed. I'm a keep push. I'm keeping it. Made them say we here, y'all. Keep it my clue. Gotta keep going. Gotta keep, going. Gotta keep running. Gotta keep running. Ain't running from none. Just running to some money. Gotta keep going. Gotta keep, going. Gotta keep running. Dang, y'all move fast. Y'all apply metrics already? All right, so check this out. On apply metrics, I like to start light. So I got like some little seated jumps. You know, probably just probably like 24 inches high, not too high. Then after that. I kind of move it up a little bit. I think I added, that's probably like eight to six inches. So you know about 30 inches right here. Doing the same little drills. For me with plyometrics, I don't want to do too much. I want to save something in the tank for the next day. Or like um, two days later. However often I do it. You get better results when you don't kill yourself doing plyometrics. You don't want to kill yourself because, like, when you're jumping, it's taking a lot a lot out of you, a lot of energy. So I miss up my plyometrics. I never tell somebody a certain number. Do it until you feel like, um, do it until you feel like, okay, I had enough. You know, don't go until you're exhausted, though. Go until about, i say, like, 70 to 80% exhaustion, right? So you don't want to be 100% exhausted when you like, I can't jump anymore. That's that's bad for plyometrics. I always remember a little is enough when it comes to plyometrics. All right. So I do different variations. I'm not gonna fast forward this part. I'm gonna let y'all watch it through so you can see all the different variations that I do. I might even stop and talk a little bit as it goes on. At this point, I wasn't taking as much rest as I should have been in between each jump. And you see, like I'm psyching myself out. I'm like, I probably bit off more than I can chew. I need a little rest, so look, boom, ah, almost, that's not bad, gotta be quick off the ground, put more power, be more explosive, bring it back, bring it back, you see, so I'm just, I say I get my mind right, so I go, boom, still, like, I'm there, but I'm not there at the same time, so I had to, uh, get, like, a little run start and jump, it's easier to do a run start than it is to, like, a depth jump, so you go down and up. Like, it's harder to do it like that. Whoa, check the athleticism. Slow-mo. Boom, up. Hat fall off. Catch it on the way down. Boy, nice with it. <laughs> nah, I'm just joking, man. But, yeah, you see the coordination, though, as I, you know, fall backwards. See, at this point, I realized, hey, bro, just relax. Just slow down and take a break if you feel like if you know you can get it, but you're not getting it, that just means that you have um, exerted a lot of energy. That's what I was saying before. With applied metrics, you don't feel like you're tired, but you really are. So I took like a two-minute break, and then boom. Look at that. 
got it. I think I probably took like four minutes. But boom, I got it. You know what I'm saying? Like easy money. Now, I just hit a few uh, pogo hops. These are more applied metric drills. I'm going to do pogo hops and then bounce, and I'm going to be out. So check it out. Listen to my boy rap music. I'm going to keep it going. I'm going to keep it pushing. Got to see what they on. Something, something, something. Hey. I'm going to keep it pushing. I'm going to keep it lit. Made me say we he on. Keep it my clues. I'm going to keep it pushing. I'm going to keep it lit. Made me say we he on. Keep it my clues. Gotta keep going. Gotta keep, going. Gotta keep running. Gotta keep running. I ain't running from none. Just running to some money. Gotta keep going. Gotta keep Gotta keep running. Right. Ain't running from none, just running to some money. I'ma keep push, I'ma keep them look. Made them say we he on, keep them my clue. I'ma keep push, I'ma keep them look. Made them say we he on, keep them my clue. Gotta keep going, gotta keep running. Ain't running from none, just running to some money. Gotta keep going, gotta keep running. Ain't running from none, just running to some money.